Welcome to KSIS Academy and now let's get into the daily news headline analysis of 3rd September 2021. Preparation for DEF Expo 2022 review, review. So a memorandum has been signed between Ministry of Defence and Gujarat government for organizing DEF Expo. DEF Expo is an Indian flagship event which showcases land, naval aid as well as homeland security systems. It is being held in Gandhinagar, Gujarat between March 10th and 13th. And the aim is to build a version to achieve self-reliance, defense, and to reach $5 billion defense export targets. Long wait for a deputy speaker for Lok Sabha. The Delhi government recently asked the union government, based on a petition filed by Pawan Rile, saying that keeping the post of deputy speaker of Lok Sabha vacant is a violation of Article 93. Article 93 of Indian Constitution says that the post of speaker and deputy speaker should be filled as soon as possible. The members have to elect both speaker and deputy speaker. And in case of vacancy of any of the two posts, it has to be filled as soon as possible by the housemates, depending upon the case. So a deputy speaker enjoys the same legislative powers as the speaker. In cases absence of the, in case of absence of the speaker because of death illness or any other reason, Deputy Speaker assumes the administrative power. So 2019 election signed Tarvata, the uh, post of Deputy Speaker has been vacant. The government has, be, uh, has, been made, has been making efforts to fill the position, but the offer was rejected by everyone approached. The combined opposition did not have the strength to elect the member of their choice. Thus, the responsibility fell on the government. The vacancy of deputy speaker is also causing uh, uh, obstructions to the processes in the parliament. Lack of GST details stumps economists. So economists are unable to analyze the tax numbers as critical data is no longer being shared by the government, despite its claiming to a rap rapid economic recovery. So government and government critical data and share share them with you. the economists the tax numbers may analyze share on key so the custom on the official statement from the finance ministry usually included details of the number of GSTR PV returns filed by taxpayers and statewide breakup of revenues. So state wise revenues December 2020 the economy only four months key provide JSRU. So with current data any kind of analysis cannot be done only we can only say if the revenues went up or down. So GST now accounts for 65% of state revenues. So lack of transparency will affect states in both their rights and they might also lose financially. Thank you.